my name is Monique Burns. I am a property manager at Great Day Property Management. We are a property management company that buys the houses ourselves. We rehab them, we place the tenants, and then we sell them to people that would like to keep the house in our management company. Um, today, my the subject of my video is truths and lies about Section 8 tenants in Detroit. But first, I'll tell you what Section 8 even is. Um, if you, most people know what food stamps are or what's more um, commonly today called a bridge card. If somebody is not making enough money to buy their own food, the government gives them a bridge card and they go to the grocery store and they're able to get groceries. Um, Section 8 is a program for people that are struggling to make enough money to pay rent. And so what the government does is they pay the rent right to the landlord. It's deposited right into my bank account every month. Not the full amount, usually um, a portion of it. So one of the first lies people think of about people on Section 8, they think, oh, people living off the system, they're so lazy and I don't want to work with them and why would you rent to them and can't you find somebody that works? I do find people that work too. I have a mix of tenants. But the truth about people with Section 8 is at least my tenants that I know of, they all work. They rarely are off work. Sometimes they're between jobs, but they work. They're typically single moms. That's a job alone in itself, but they work and they're moms. And most of my tenants use that money to help put themselves that, you know, that, that they don't have to spend all their money on rent, which is the biggest bill. They will um, put themselves through college. And I think that's really cool because it changes the whole dynamic of the family. Another lie that people think about Section 8 tenants, and I've had other landlords say this to me bold faced and I can't believe it. They say, well, they trash your house, those people. The truth is they don't, they don't do that because they will lose their voucher, Section 8 voucher. And once they get on the program, which is very hard to get on to, they're not about to lose it. And if I have to evict them and they get an eviction on their record, they are in severe danger of losing their voucher. So they are not people that trash the house. Not to mention that once a year, the house is inspected, and which is great because the um, Section 8 inspector comes through, they find things like missing batteries and smoke detectors and other things. And those things are all repaired, which is a nice, it's nice to have a record that the house is in great working order. At least once a year, you've got it in writing in another way besides your own record keeping. Um, another lie about Section 8 tenants is that they move all the time. You know, these people, I don't like that, those people kind of comments because it's just not true. Once I'm face to face with everybody, you learn that people are people everywhere, but um, that they're not stable, they move. So they're in and out and you get all this kind of turnover. Well, the truth in Detroit with my tenants is that I have found that I just think is really cool. Even people in the suburbs don't know the secret, I guess. They choose to live near their families. They want to live near their auntie, their grandma, their sister. That's where they want to live. And if my house is for rent in a neighborhood anywhere near their family, they're not moving. They don't move for a really long time. Or they choose to live in my houses, particularly because I have the best houses and I am in thriving neighborhoods. They don't want to live in what I call a war zone area. So my tenants stay. My, um, I, we started in like 08 was when we first started buying houses, started placing tenants in 09. Uh, I have a lot of those same tenants. I have not had a ton of turnover and I make an effort, a really big effort to find people that fit that kind of criteria that really want to stay for all the right reasons. I am going to make a part two about the truths and lies of Section 8 tenants, so tune in and watch that one. Meanwhile, you could call me, 248-390-3982. You can look at my website, greatdaypropertymanagement.com, or you could go down below and like it or make a comment. But be kind in your comments because if you're not, I reserve the right to evict you.